Everyone, welcome back to Build Tune Race, and it's time to get Bernie ready for some more burnouts. I thought we were done for the year. Put Bernie in the trailer. It's getting cold here in Colorado. Until I saw this post that Hoonigan put out that they're doing another burn yard at SEMA, and that's been one of the goals for Bernie is to get him into SEMA and do some burnouts with the Hoonigan guys since I saw a couple years ago that they've been doing this. And then I went on to Zach from Hoonigan's Instagram, and he said, hey, tag us if you're interested, if you're about that life, if you do burnouts and all that type of stuff. So that's exactly what I did. And... A little bit later, Zach reached out and he's like, hey man, let's get you in here, let's do this. So then I sent him all my information. And now in about 12 hours, we're heading to SEMA to do burnouts with the Hoonigan. So it's time to get Bernie out, get him ready. So let's get to it. Let's see if the old burn deadly will fire up. If you have a vehicle on E and it's cold out and the car hasn't ran yet today, you know the struggles I'm having right now. A little cold. A little cold blooded. fit if i really wanted to try to pull it in here but i don't know if i'd mess with that so uh, i got some oil everything got that a little bit earlier been running around trying to get everything got some tires flip to that little clip right now so i'm at walmart they have plenty of tires we're gonna go ahead and grab four of these and throw some on the 18 so they're mounting those up right now so hopefully this gets us through the uh, whole seam of it hopefully bernie stays together for six whole burnouts and uses all these tires up well at least we got those ready to go and then i also have these which are the same as what i got some other spares and then i also got a new set of 18s to go on those rims so uh this is what's kind of crazy about the hoonigan burnyard deal at sema is it's two shows each day i told them i should be able to do every show uh so 11 and 3 the second third and fourth not the fifth sema ends on the fifth but uh so for those three days two shows a day and hopefully Bernie can pop some tires each time out, do a whole bunch of burnouts and put on a whole bunch of shows. Usually we travel to an event, put on, do one burnout and we're done. This one might be doing six burnouts in three days, which would be pretty awesome. So I got to get this oil changed and then load up some tires and get the truck on the trailer. And then we hopefully are ready to go. Well, there it is. Fresh oil is in that unit and uh, I can't stand up underneath the lift when it's down like that. So stretch the back out and got a little bit of mess going but i think new oils in it topped off the water because in some of the other burns with getting warm it does kick out a little bit of water not a ton so i just want to make sure we're good for six burnouts we might need some more uh otherwise i think we're pretty much there all right so i think i'm pretty close got uh, some wheels and tires mounted here got our jack gonna need to grab some tools to throw in here but otherwise bernie's about ready i was gonna swap those the better looking wheels for sema you know car show rolling in but uh, if we decide to do something out there, we'll get out there. But it's getting late. We got to leave super early in the morning. I just need to get this thing on the trailer. Got some nitrous. Probably going to need to get some more out there in Vegas. Uh, my dad might have a few extra nitrous bottles too. Hopefully we have enough fuel and then uh, some tools and stuff like that. ready for SEMA. So we'll be leaving here at like 5 a.m. tomorrow, maybe 6, hopefully earlier than better, but uh, 12 and a half hour drive from Colorado to Vegas, and we need to get there and get moved in all in the same day. I'm hoping, if not, maybe we can roll in first thing Tuesday morning. Still trying to figure all that out. So here we are, going to get burnout yard at SEMA. So we're gonna get Bernie unloaded here in a minute, but we made it 12 and a half hours or something. But just stoked to be here. Seema's right there, big convention center's right behind us, and couldn't be in better right now. Got wet. <laughs> <laughs> He's the only one to 
brings all these extra tires. Nobody else comes to pop, pop tires. <laughs> <laughs> well, we came pop tires. The only thing Bernie does. What a, you know, some people uh, build show cars and we build trucks that pop tires, so we made it too. There it is, looking good right next to the Pit Viper truck. And uh, take a look real quick while we got time here tonight. We got a couple other cool rides in here. Limo deal from Pit Viper, I think, and then this truck. I think that thing's been to Colorado before. And then a couple drift cars, like that, uh, that one there. Nice Mustang. This thing's pretty sick too, this GTO. I don't think the transit van's gonna be doing it though. But uh, otherwise, yeah, a couple drift cars and this thing's pretty sick. Little twin turbo LS still. This car's cool. It's like on a Lexus chassis, this thing is. Oh, I don't know, no? It's like a Ford 4.6 or something actually in it. Huh, interesting. So, all right guys, tiny little preview about what's to come over the next few days. You know what to do, hit that subscribe button. See you guys in the next one.